Hey guys, come with me to my last restaurant week stop. As you can see, I decided to buy all our cute little simple fancy dress just to go there because I said we are saving the best for last and oh, it was the best. It didn't took long for us to get our food or to be seated and I love how this place is because they still have no alcohol. So we literally had like Coca-Cola, Apple G and I had the orange wine just to match my dress and wow, that was literally fresh and refreshing. So here is me just taking a sip and being like, oh, cutesy, cutesy, all demure. But trust me, I'm here to put on. So here it is. We have our steak. This was medium. And the other one was medium. Well, and that there is a chimichurri sauce. First time I had chimichurri sauce. And wow, it actually enhanced the flavor. So this is me taking a bite. And wow, that was like a lot of flavor enhanced with the chimichurri it was not chewy it was perfect and as you can see all the size that was large this is our lamb we got four pieces each this is medium well and medium and now i'm going to like take a bite because i'm a big lamb fan and that just melted in my mouth like butter i was like oh my gosh where did it go and the flavors was there and as you all can see what's the sizes of the shrimp what's the portion what's the sauce that was cheesy and i never tried to make shrimp cheesy before creamy yes cheesy but it was rich in flavor and i loved it i loved it it's like i wanted to blush and here we are with a little bit of um veggies and we have some mashed potato i already scooped out mine so i was like real hungry as i said i came here to put down and while i tasted this potatoes this thing melted in my mouth it didn't even have no lungs so if you don't have no teeth no worries and this is the alfredo they use uh, spaghetti noodles which i love and um when i tasted that that was creamy and i think that paired very well with the shrimp because it's like you know alfredo shrimp alfredo and it was worth it our bill came up to like 700 and something because we ordered drinks i think it was 734 dollars and um it was worth it because they don't serve pork they don't serve any sort of alcohol it was basically 350 for two persons basically breaking it down to 175 per person and here i am here stuffing my face because as i said i came here to put down even though i'm supposed to be on a diet but it is protein it is healthy it is grilled and this was definitely the best for last and i could not help but like stuff my stomach i wish i could have come here twice i can't wait for meat fest i can't wait until they have like a restaurant week for next year and obviously you know i have to take a photo with the man himself the man of the hour mr paul a grant and then we ended up south park just to finish off the night with a couple drinks and here is my review when i came home all right so now i'm home so i could finally do a you know recap so i will say paul was one of the best that i have had when it's, it comes to restaurant week the food you got for the price because it's basically like 175 a person obviously we spent on drinks so our bill came up to 7 to the 4 if i'm not mistaken because again it was three of us and um the drinks wasn't really much because it was like 15 dollars but obviously when you add in your service charge and fat the ambience was nice it was busy had nice music it had no problem for park when we reached there they had a security which was really nice we were seated we didn't have to wait too long food was really nice it was done to our perfection how we liked it because i saw someone who went there again everyone's taste vary and they were like they didn't like it and i saw some of the comments and i was like okay i'm kind of like thinking twice because i had burgers from them and i was like looking forward to go in and i was thinking twice but i could actually say to those people i mean respectfully your taste may vary but for me it was worth it i enjoyed it and to me it's like either you went on a really off day or you just need flavor in your palate but Paul A. Grant was worth it for restaurant week. I can't wait for Meat Fest that they're going to have in October. And I can't wait for next year if they're having restaurant week again. So that's it.